Mother Sunday, run, run. M Mother Sunday, head to the border. What's up, dudes? What's Welcome up? back. Oh. Uh, I'm going kangaroo shark. We're hunting. about to uh, find the secrets of the Tower of Love and Peace on this week's mother, today's mother, Sunday mother, second mother of the week. How about that Kaizo though? Crazy. I'm having a hard time comboing now. It's because the melodies are like a little bit more complex. This is the same one we've heard earlier. Da ba da ba da ba da da ba da da ba da. Beef jerky, hey! <sighs> Just avoid him. He's slow. He's a turtle, right? Oh, there's more than one. Oh, I'm finding both of them. Or just one. Yeah, just one. I think he's too slow to like get in on the battle. So yeah, basically you're just gonna go around here, and then there's gonna be like some items, and then you go down, and then there's gonna be like the warehouse grounds thunder. I guess this is where they make claymen. Gotcha. Is at this tower. Oh no! Just a lot of damage across the board to us. It's such a gnarly barley. It's a it a gnarly barley. So last- yesterday's question was about relaxing songs and about, uh, side characters. But let's talk today about, uh, like, what's- what's an enemy that you can remember from an RPG, uh, be it turn-based or not, where you run into it and you're like, Oh, shit! Like, it's just like two- you- you just fight it and then you're like, well, like that cow. Like the uh, rattlesnake cow. For me, it was the- the, uh, whew. Like how smooth that was? Yeah, it's great. It's another one like up to the left, yeah. He got you. No, I got him. That's a good way of thinking about it. What were you gonna say? <laughs> I forgot. The uh, enemy that made you go like, oh. The Capricorn kisses from uh, Mario RPG. Oh yeah? Those guys drove me crazy. You were just like, oh no. For me, it's the super mutants from Fallout 3. First time you run into them, they just like beat the hell out of you. Yeah. Or like I said, like or like I said yesterday, those T Rexes from Final Fantasy XII that just like teach you who's boss. Bam. Oh yeah. So you can go down and up and around and go into the warehouse. Uh, and there's a vending machine that has basically the same stuff from the mole shop. <laughs> Oh, no! But there's also some other, like, you know, disposable items. And apparently, uh, once we enter the factory, it's the point of no return. What does that mean? Like, we can't go back and get anything from the outside for a while, so... Okay. But we already have the pamphlet, so we're good. That's the main thing that it mentions that we're gonna need. All right. Well, you heard the man. We got the pamph. Yeah, and if you're wondering where I'm getting this information from, it's from handbook.fangamer.com, where you can get the the Fangamer handbook. It's a really Shout cool book. Shout out to book. Fangamer just for being so yeah. good. They have not paid us in any way. I just we have yeah, this book. Yeah, no, no, they haven't. They haven't paid us. Yeah, and we're not taking payment from no, them. No, no. I just I really am impressed with the way that they make like fan merch. Really cool. So this is it, huh? Yeah, that's the vending machine. I think you might be able to go... Do we need anything from it? A cup of pork noodles... A recollection bell... Paper fan... Everything else is exactly the same... As the mole shop. Anti-paralysis... Feeling sick... Paper fan... Yeah, we don't need any of this stuff. I mean, I'm sure we do, but whatever. I'm ready. Are you ready? Yeah! Jump anything, on in! Anything we need to know before we go inside? Not now. All right, diving in. Here we go. Hey, do you take your mask off when you go to the bathroom? No, I leave it on, bro. Why you take yours off? You go through all that trouble in the bathroom, then you go through all the trouble putting it back on when you're done. 
Yeah, I go through the trouble. I mean, there is a place in there to hang your mask and all. Oh man, you're dumb. It's no f it's not for you to hang your mask. It's where you hang your bags and umbrellas and stuff like that. So weird. Oh, I always thought it was for masks. So that's why it's always been sort of hang my mask there. It's like the Venture Brothers. Hey Henchman you, what's stuff. your guys' problem? What are you looking at? Ah, oh, he's a... Uh... Later, man. Later. What's all the ruckus? What in blazes are you? Sir, I wasn't aware you were here, sir. Please forgive my rudeness. What? Wearing such a f shabby outfit will set a bad example to, to the men, Commander. Here, I'll prepare a change for clothes for you right away. Please put this on right away, sir. Likewise for the company folks for you, too. Why do they think that Lucas... <laughs> Alright, that's better. Well, I had better return to my duties. What is Bonnie wearing? Look at this sort of misunderstanding, but it's perfect for us. Now let's go find that thing before they figure out who we are. Let me see Bonnie. Ha. <sighs> Okay, uh, so talk to the guy on the left. Fall the way to the left. Yep, I'm so sorry. Um, here's a present from the bottom of my heart, sir. I had always wondered for this for you. Not for any reason, though. Strictly in a friend sense. I don't know exactly what those are for. What is- what are they for? But now you have two of them. I felt something warm inside my heart. And then go up the ladder, and go to the left, and there should be something cool for you as well. What? I don't know, man. <laughs> what? We heard a woogie boogie with a rhythm and then that was it? Yeah, it man. It didn't do anything else? Alright, I guess we're going inside, right? Yeah. Uh, there's a machine in this room that gives you full health. I want that machine. What are all the... the pig masks saying? When clamming break down or malfunction, they take themselves to the garbage area. Talk about convenient. Dude, this is... I don't like this. It's like soiling green stuff. Yeah. Hello, Commander. What's that? You're looking for a clayman? Huh? Clayman that's gone haywire? Come on, Commander. I know there's no need for me to say this, but our product development is flawless. We've never made anything that might go berserk or malfunction. No, sir. Just saw an out of control claim and run at the back door. If you're looking for it, you better hurry before it gets stuffed inside the garbage truck and taken to the dump. Well, the only high notes, but something crazy to get you such t Oh, you can't say? It's be embarrassing, huh? Well, you know, screw you, guy. I'm your commander. Don't talk to me like that. I'm your command. Oh, there he is. No. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Later, man. <gasps> no! Oh, no. We need that. No! Later, man. Can't let it get away. Ran! Do we need anything in here? It doesn't look like there's anything. The frog. I'm gonna save it enough. Alright, here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> A pig on wheels. The so wound up roadhog. It's like ball wheels. So this thing has 420. Uh, Smoke weed every lame. Alright. Yeah, it, you know what? It is weird that it's HP is 420, and it has a 10% chance of dropping the secret herb. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, come on. If you're lucky, it will drop it. 10% chance. 420 HP. I think he's not so bad. Great. Fire and crying. Oh, oh, oh shit. Wow, he's pretty rough. Mm, 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 mm. Dude, that was... That was we rough. didn't get the machine to give us full life. Because we really could use that. You go back and get it. I don't... Was it in there, in that room? Yeah, it was in the back. Uh, up and to the right. Right there. Damn. I should have realized that. Okay, so it says that you're gonna run through one tunnel, and then it says... Once you... Once you enter the second tunnel, you might consider healing up and giving Boney a DCMC pamphlet, some bombs, and healing items. Well, the healing items is no problem. Boney's got those in spades.
get out of here. And we got a mini boss coming up. So make sure, by the time you get through the tunnel, that Boney has the pamphlet. Because it, we're about to fight a mini boss. We're gonna fight that big bulky dude from Club Titty Boo from okay. earlier. And so, uh, it, Boney needs to have the, uh, the pamphlet, and then we gotta be ready to do a couple different moves. Lucas has the offense up and down moves too, right? Sorry, what was that? Lucas also has the PK moves where he can put your offense up and down, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So give the pamphlet to Boney. Okay. And then, uh, yeah. You need to equip it or something? No. It's an item. What do you mean, it's an item? It's like a usable item. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. So, you're, you're good for now. Um, is this the second tunnel? First. Okay. They say stick to the sidewalk if you want to avoid confrontations. I don't want to fight those guys. They're not... They're right, not second tunnel. They're not super good. Okay, so now you're in the second tunnel. Oh my god. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's you, Commander. I'm terribly sorry, sir. From the looks of it, it appears that you mistakenly threw something in the garbage. You head to the garbage dump. Please follow the truck in this. Why are they helping us so much? The garbage dump is northeast of here. Please hurry after it. Retrieve whatever is embarrassing that was in there. Please be careful on the slip and get in an accident either. Alright. So there is a map here. I, I don't really understand it though. Look. Oh my god, we just crashed. We just crash it? Oh god. Holy right. shnikes. Yeah. Oh, Commander, are you alright? That damn facade's been tossing banana peels over the place, so it's also easy to zip on them. Here, take my pork bean if you'd like. Mm-mm. Huh? I'm not sure why, but you smell like a dog and a kid. <laughs> You're that kid from Club Titaboo. Maybe you think you can fool everyone, but there's no fooling my wild nose. You sneaky piece of scum pretending to be our commander. Let's roll! Alright, so, opening attacks. Lucas, offense up on Duster. Alrighty. Duster, scary mask. Kumatora, offense down. Bony pamphlet. So we got out the, out the gate. Bam, twenty-five. <laughs> <laughs> He's a big fan of the band, man. Wow. Jesus. What? Why is he jealous? Who cares, dude? All right, now he's got 1,758 HP. Okay. So he has a soft spot for the merchandise, so just use it to distract him and then beat the crads out of him. All right. If you want to lower his defense, too, I mean, I'm sure it'll work. That's defense up. Oh, oops. So don't worry about it, yeah. PK Beards. I'm gonna keep attacking at this point, and then you... Yeah, I, mean, I don't we, think we, we don't have, have a defense yeah. down, so... I think Duster might, but... He's got to be putting in the attacks. Um... Fire... Freeze Thunder? Let me see. Okay. Fierce Pork Trooper. Here we go. Okay, Thunder, 70 damage. He's jealous. <laughs> he's- he's weak to the fire. Alrighty. Yeah, we're doing some serious damage to him. PK fire. At 110. He... 
He, he hasn't attacked once, right? No. He's been jealous of that pamphlet. Yeah. See if uh, you can use Duster's uh, uh, like offense down or defense down. Yeah. There we go. We're just. Oh. Oh yeah, he's on fire. Burn damage. Okay. Oh, you're back to normal. <laughs> okay. And so here he goes. Ooh. Powerful swing. All right. So I think you should use the pamphlet on him again. Absolutely. And then see if Duster's got some some abilities that uh, lower defense. Yeah. That fire going. And then show him the pamphlet again. This has got to be the most funny item I've ever seen. <laughs> He's just super into it. He can't handle it. The fierce poor trooper's utterly mesmerized by the DCMC merchandise pamphlet. He loves it, dude. By nine. Look at PK this. PK fire. Look at this teamwork. This should be over. Look at this. This is 87 damage on <laughs> burn. Yeah. It's like almost... Dude, this is it. Dead. Yeah, we just... Crushed that Crushed dude. him. So he gives you a pickled veggie plate when you beat him. 1500 experience? Everyone leveled up. Yeah, dude. Everyone leveled up. They had to have. Yeah, Kumator leveled up. Can you give me that bony? Bony leveled up? The only one who didn't level up was Lucas. I don't know why... He gives you this plate. Alright. Not it's bad, but don't think it's over just yet. It only recovers 10 HP. <laughs> wow. Alright, so, uh, with that, maybe we should call it for today. Really? Right? Well, what do I do? What we do I do? To, we gotta explore oh. the- There's a whole, like, area to explore. If you look right there, that's the map, I think. Is that not the map? Oh. Uh, it's north of the crash site. North? Yeah. So here. Yeah. It's gonna be a map to look at somewhere in here. Got it, that's it. Can you get out? You might be like parked on it. Oh, there you go. Highway map. Highway map. Yeah, so now you can look at the map and you can go. But oh, you're also in to? the pork bean. Yeah, okay, so. Oh man, look at this. Okay, where do we need to go? So right now, if you go to the left, that takes you to the runaway mouse. Okay. Um, there's runaway mice everywhere, actually. Um, head north where there's a construction gap in the highway and talk to the mama mouse. Oof. And then she'll give you, she'll give you a reward if you find all seven mice. Is it a side mission? Yeah. I don't know where the hell she is. Oh! What? No way. What did you just do? I pressed the load save button, the load state button. Are you kidding? Because down in R from Kaizo. Oh my god, we have a lot of work to do, guys. All right, we're going to call it. Yeah, okay. We have to call it. <laughs> okay. I, this was a horrible... We're going to call it. We'll get back to the mice hunt. Uh, for next week. Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. All right. God damn it. All right. Um, Later. But yeah, we'll, 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 when we come back next week, we'll, we'll start right back where we were with, after that boss fight. <sighs> Later, Later, man. man.